Under this area of the conceptual frameworks, we'll look at culture learning and the stress and coping mechanism for the effective area. And so here I created a little bit of a, a graphic to kind of distill this a little bit for our understanding in a cross-cultural situation for adaptation in the socio-cultural area, learning the social skills generally, and then in a domain-specific area for a specific job, if you're an educator, if you're working for a company in HR or doing some training for a company, that would be in that socio-cultural area, your job performance. Generally in your social skills and how you would interact with that group. And then psychological would be more of the your personal well-being, generally speaking, and then your domain-specific job satisfaction. So those things will affect that and your understanding. In this graphic, and under cultural learning through a context, the cultural context here at the top, and then the organizational context at the bottom, you see the individual characteristics that stand out. These will be different for each person depending on their experiences and what cultural grid they're coming from, plus the learning opportunities they have within another culture, also what training they have, any kind of overseas experience or intercultural experience, living within a multicultural society, what has influenced them. And over time, they will be able to blend these two into some specific cultural skills and behaviors to help them assimilate and adapt into that new culture.